In the heart of a quaint village nestled between rolling hills, there lived a kind and gentle woodcarver named Illy. Illy was known far and wide for his exquisite craftsmanship. Creating intricate figurines and beautiful sculptures from the wood he harvested from the surrounding forests. But what truly set Illy apart was not just his exceptional skill but also his unwavering compassion for all living beings. One crisp morning, as the sun's golden rays danced upon the dew-kissed grass, a traveling minstrel named Arya arrived in the village. Arya carried with her a violin. The instrument she had mastered to perfection, capable of weaving melodies that could evoke joy, sorrow, and everything in between. Eager to share her music, Arya set up near Illy's humble workshop. As she played, her melodies painted the air with a tapestry of emotions, and villagers gathered around, spellbound by her performance. Among the crowd was Illy who had momentarily put aside his carving tools to listen. As the final note lingered in the air, the villagers erupted in applause, their hearts stirred by the enchanting music. Arya smiled gratefully, her eyes meeting Illy's as he stepped forward. Your music is like a balm for the soul, he said. His voice warm with appreciation. Arya bowed gracefully. Thank you, kind sir. Your craftsmanship is equally mesmerizing. Illy's eyes twinkled. Would you do me the honor of playing alongside me? Your violin and my woodwork could create something truly unique. Arya agreed with a nod. And thus began an extraordinary collaboration. Illy crafted delicate wooden figurines that depicted scenes of nature. While Arya's violin wove melodies that seemed to breathe life into each creation. The village soon buzzed with excitement. As people from neighboring villages journeyed to witness the magical collaboration. One evening, a heavy rainstorm engulfed the village. The downpour was relentless, and the river that ran alongside the village swelled dangerously. As the villagers huddled in their homes, Illy noticed a lonely and frightened stray dog shivering under a tree near his workshop. Without a second thought, he rushed out into the rain, scooped up the dog, and brought it into his workshop. Arya, having sought shelter from the rain, watched Illy's compassionate act from a distance. Impressed by his kindness, she decided to compose a melody that would capture the essence of Illy's compassion. In the workshop, as Illy gently dried the dog with a towel, Arya's violin sang out. The melody was tender with notes that mirrored the dripping rain outside. It was a song of empathy, of extending a hand to those in need. Illy's heart swelled with emotion, and as he looked into the dog's grateful eyes, he understood the power of compassion. Days turned into weeks, and the collaboration between Illy and Arya continued to flourish. Their creations were no longer merely wood and music. They were an embodiment of the compassion that flowed through their souls. The villagers cherished their works, not just for their aesthetic beauty, but for the profound message they carried. As time passed, the rain-soaked memory of that stormy night became a story passed down through generations. The tale of the woodcarver and the minstrel who joined forces to create art that inspired. Compassion lived on. Reminding people of the transformative power of empathy. And so, the village that was once known for its hills and woods gained a new reputation. One of a place where the symphony of compassion echoed in the hearts of its people. A melody that could be heard in the rustling leaves, the flowing river, and the acts of kindness that flourished like wildflowers in spring.